Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to let you know that if you are using Microsoft ClipChamp, which is the native video editing app on both Windows 10 and Windows 11, that replaced the legacy video editor a while back, as you may well know, that there are two small changes that Microsoft has announced over on their Microsoft 365 roadmap which I think if you are using the video editor may be a nice move as I would say in the right direction. Now as you may well know currently in ClipChamp if you want to edit a video so if we click on create a new video the video editor is only available in dark mode and I think this is a small yet significant change that Microsoft is going to make because apparently the video editor is also going to get a light mode and it's also going to get what they are calling a simplified video editing experience because as you can see things looking quite cluttered and I think this needs a little bit of work so it's basically going to be simplified and you'll also be able to change the dark theme to a light theme if you so wish which I think is great and the entry over on Microsoft 365 roadmap reads as and I'm quoting this change will simplify the ClipChamp editing experience and increase the space you have on the stage to make great videos. We're also introducing light mode as a new option for people to choose whether they view the ClipChamp editor in a light or dark scheme. So both these changes are going to be available over the next coming weeks. So if you are using the app, just check back from time to time. And the light theme will also be available in Microsoft ClipChamp for the web and also the desktop app as I've demonstrated today. So I think that's a nice move having the option obviously to change the video editor to light theme and it's going to be interesting to see if they ever bring a dark theme to the actual home page or the main interface of the ClipChamp app. No mention of that but at least this is a step in the right direction. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.